What's going on YouTube, Dennis here, and today we are going to be buying some stocks on Cash App Invest. Now, I have multiple different investing portfolios with different brokerages, and this one, I kinda wanna just test some stuff out, maybe take you guys through a journey of what it's like to invest just a couple of bucks every single day or even week, and see how that has an impact on your investing. So, you can see right over here, we have our screen up for Cash App. Now, if you don't have the app and you're interested, I'll have a link for them down below, but I will also have a referral code that will give you some free startup cash to be able to start investing with. Now there are some stipulations, so follow along. And also too, I will have a link down below where you can go ahead and get some additional free stocks with other brokerages. Now here on this cash app, what we're gonna do is click on the little tab there uh, that kind of looks like a, a Bitcoin and some stock stuff. And it takes us to the investing portion. Now I did a little bit of testing out with investing here uh, a while back for uh for actually my main channel but uh what i wanted to do today was kind of just show you guys um maybe some of the stocks i want to do here and uh i actually already have them followed so i'm going to be investing into these five different companies uh unfortunately i should have started this yesterday because today they had a great growth um so it's all right no worries we're going to be kind of just testing all this stuff out so um, you can see here the stocks that I'm going to be buying into are Neo, Upstart, uh, X, uh, EXP World, uh, Square, and Chewy. Now, you know the reasons I went for these companies. One, I'm not really investing a lot of my you know big money into this. This is going to be a dollar at a time, so it's you know if I lose some money, whatever. This is also just to kind of show you guys uh, the fun kind of journey here. I have my real investing with like M1 Finance and uh, Vanguard and stuff like that. So. Uh, some of these are going to be much riskier plays, so keep that in mind if you're going to be interested in checking these companies out. Do additional research for yourself. So, uh, one of the big interesting ones is Square. So, in case you don't know, Cash App is actually owned by Square. Uh, so, that is actually a really cool kind of situation there where you're investing in the company that you're utilizing to buy the stocks with. So, I think that's kind of cool. So, what we're going to do here is uh, we're going to go into each one of these. You can see Neo currently is up 17%. Uh, it's still down about 7% for the week, down 27% for the last month. Um, so let's go ahead and buy some of these. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna be doing a dollar at this point. Trust me, I know it's not a lot of money, but what I wanna do is just kind of show you guys the impact a dollar can have uh, in these kind of investments. So we're gonna go ahead and buy in for a dollar here. It's gonna do my face ID. So of course it kind of just goes over all this stuff. Make sure you read through this if you really wanna uh, be cautious with everything. So we're gonna go ahead and confirm on this right over here. Goes through, so we purchased $1 of NEO, boom. All right, our investing journey begins. So next up we're gonna be doing Upstart. Let's go ahead and buy $1 of Upstart. And also too, while we're doing this, by the way, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button because what we're gonna be doing is kind of showing updates on this portfolio as well. Plus we have portfolio updates for like M1 Finance, uh, we do Robinhood, Vanguard, and we do SoFi Invest. So man, we got a lot of different portfolios running all at the same time. So if you guys wanna see the madness, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So we got EXP World here, putting in a dollar. By the way, I don't know if you guys saw, we already went down one cent on Upstart. Right over here, let's go ahead and finish this off. Woo, dollar. Yeah, you can see Upstart, we're already down uh, one penny. Oh no, didn't buy at the right time. Uh, that's the one downside with uh, with buying on Cash App is that you can't really be buying uh, at, a, at a specific dollar amount. It's pretty much uh, just, not a dollar amount, limit, uh, limit buys. So it's all market orders. So that's not really the best thing in the world, but whatever. All right, so we got a dollar coming in right now for Square. Boom. Like I said, that's kind of a cool thing to be able to invest in the company that you're utilizing to do your investings with. All right, so we got that. And the last one up here is going to be Chewy. Let's go ahead and add this in. I, I honestly just picked a couple different companies uh, in different sectors in some ways just to kind of be a little bit more uh, split up with some of these. Uh, but yeah, so now we can see here, so our total investment is gone through. Uh, let's see if it shows it here, yeah. So look, we were supposed to be at five bucks and then it's now down to 4.99, but no worries. Uh, we're in this for a little bit more than just, you know, a quick turnaround. Although if some of the stocks grow exponentially, we'll see how that works out. Actually, upstarts back up to a dollar. That's actually kind of cool. So we got a dollar in every single one of these and Neo just went up uh, $1 and one penny, which is pretty awesome that it's kind of like showing up there in real time, of course. Uh, so you can see that it's like 
pickle right there for a second. So uh, let's go ahead and click on our details here. So current investment is $5. Unrealized gains, one penny. We're up 0.20%. Uh, that is freaking phenomenal. Uh, some of these numbers might be a little different just because like I said, I've done investing on here before. So those might show up there. But as far as our journey here with these five stocks, uh, this is what we're going to do. We're going to be investing in these. Um, I'm going to try to do a dollar a day during the market days. Uh, I, I'll do updates for you guys every couple of days. So again, make sure you're following along so you can get those updates on there because I'll post them up here. So you guys can see um, if you guys want to check out Cash App and some of the other investing apps out there that can give you some free stock because free stock is awesome because you can test out those platforms. I'll have a link for them down below. It supports out the channel as well too, which is always great. So that way I can use some more money so I can invest in these companies. Now, uh, let me know in the comments too. Do you guys think these are good stocks to go with? Um, you know, What are your takes on some of these companies? Uh, I'm not as worried about these companies as I am with like my M1 finance where I do a lot of extensive research. I pay attention to things going on. This one is honestly a little bit more for fun. Uh, you know, just testing some stuff out, seeing how it goes. Uh, the interesting thing is with these, I can't do manual buys or sorry, uh, automatic buys unless I do $10 a day minimum. So if I do daily, I had to go in here and do them manually. So I'll, I'll do my best to try to remember to come in here and do the $1 at a time uh, to try to see how much of an impact this can have for us. So you can see here, we're already at a penny in growth, which is freaking phenomenal. Uh, but obviously we're gonna have to keep going from there. And for anybody that's curious, they also have Bitcoin on here. Um, I only got five in here, but I got more uh, with like Coinbase and some of the stock uh, brokerages as well too, when it comes to uh, Bitcoin and some other cryptocurrency too. But that's this journey right over here. Uh, so what we can do here is uh, just kind of keep paying attention, uh, keep learning more about these companies. I'll probably kind of pay a little bit more closer attention to these now that I have some money in there. Uh, but I, like I said, I picked these out just to kind of go through the motions. Uh, one, a lot of these had some massive downfalls. You could see here like with Upstart was down 30% just in the last month with everything going on. Uh, Neo was down 26%. Square was down only 8.5%. So not as big of a dip, but I... Again, I think it's cool that we're investing in them since they, they own Cash App. Uh, EXP World is down 30, pretty much 35%. And then Chewy, I think, was the least out of all. No, well, I guess it's still pretty bad. It was down 28%. So I picked interesting companies that, you know, maybe we'll see some really nice upswing. Maybe we'll lose some money. Uh, we'll have to wait and see and uh, kind of go through that motion. Look at that. Now we're up two cents. That's per pretty awesome. So Follow along, we'll see how it goes. And what I want you to do next is actually check out this next video right over here so you can check out some of my other portfolios here on the channel. My name is Dennis and I'll see you guys in that next video.